we really believe um, that downtown, you know, urban life um, will come back. There's no doubt commercial real estate's going to feel, certainly in some of these larger cities, some impact as people are, um, you know, accelerating some of this sort of work from home. We're all on Zoom calls. We're all on web webinars. You know, I'm sitting in our office today. Our office here in Akron and our office in Jacksonville has been back. Uh, you know, fully staffed since since June, uh, and 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 we're continuing to find safe ways to plan events. Uh, you know, we just had you know two movie nights this past weekend at the ballpark in Jacksonville. We're hosting high school senior spotlight baseball games here for those students that missed playing their spring season, right? Because of COVID, we're bringing those teams back together, getting the uniforms on to give them one more night under the lights to play with their buddies, have their families and friends safely socially distanced and watching them play baseball. And so what I would say to you is downtown matters. Downtown Jacksonville matters. It's communities like Akron and Cleveland and, and those across the country. I'm from the DC area. Driving through DC right now is pretty quiet. People are not you know, taking the Metro and lining the commercial office spaces, but it will come back. Um, it, it's you know, being together and that sort of human connection and the importance of being together, both from an events perspective from a real estate perspective, people wanting to be downtown, you know, that, that is not going to change. I believe thematically we're seeing a pause, um, but by no means, you know, some kind of a structural interruption. I interesting, right? The, the, the word we're all talking about in business right now is pivoting, right? And, um, and we're all pivoting to try and build and re-understand what our businesses can be in this period. Back at the post, when, when 2008 hit, um, we, were, we were dealing with a different kind of pivot, right, during the financial crisis. Th there was actually a structural change being accelerated in our business. Less people were reading print newspapers and more people were reading digital and ultimately on iPads and iPhones and, and any other kind of device. So that really changed their news behavior. And that pivot was a permanent, what I would consider sort of fundamental structural change to that business. We don't feel, at least my perspective is, that that is, that is going to change the way that people live their lives post-COVID. I believe people will continue to come to ballparks. People will continue to go to shopping malls. People will continue to come and work in commercial office spaces. And people most certainly will want to live downtown in communities like Jacksonville that are continuing to grow uh, at an astronomical pace. And so we're certainly seeing a pause um, and I'm not smart enough to understand when that pause will end. I'll leave that to Greg and his team. Uh, but we're, we're, we're certainly very bullish about downtown living.